Hi guys and welcome to my kitchen. The reason we are filming in my kitchen is because it is currently the only room in my house that is clean-ish. Just avoid the table right there. Yeah, nope, nope, can't see that. Uh, but anyways, I made the last minute decision to do Vlogmas this year. Now, you might be asking yourself, Corinne, what is Vlogmas? Well, pretty much it is like a YouTuber advent calendar, only instead of getting to open a nice door every day to a piece of chocolate or a nice gift, you get to watch a video every day of my face because that's what the world wants. And you're probably sitting there like, we did not ask for that. What? No, no. <laughs> that was terrible. Uh, but anyways, I made the last minute decision to make Vlogmas a thing this year for myself. So that means you're going to get to see nice, rugged Corinne with her hair and a ponytail and a hat that has sweat stains and sweatshirts and things that I wear to work because I made the lovely decision to work eight to five Mondays through Saturday. Yep, you counted six days a week because Corinne decided to be a farmer. And you're probably like, Korean farming's a seven day a week job. But nope, nope, we have trees, not cows. So you don't have to get up every day to milk an almond. It's pretty nice, it's great. But anyway, since this was a last minute decision, I do not have a video planned for today and I don't wanna make this just a talking at the camera video, but that's what it's gonna be. So I'm gonna have a little story time about the tree that I decided to buy today. Now, I come from a family that every year we trek up into the mountains of California, whether there be snow, rain, this year fire, <laughs> campfire. And so every year we trek up there and cut down a tree. Now in my family, we have this long standing tradition where might have a low battery, we'll see how this goes. Where we do not use chainsaws, we have to use hand saws. And I'm talking like this saw came over on the Mayflower and it's old. So you trek through the mountains and you're trekking through the snow that is knee deep and you're trekking through, you got a friend with you and you're like, we're gonna go find the perfect tree. So you're hiking and you're hiking and you find the perfect tree. And you're like, yep, this is it. <clears throat> you bust out your handsaw and you go, do we really have to use this? And they go, it builds character, Corinne. And I'm like, well, it's building something else and I'm pretty sure I need tetanus for it. Uh, but anyways, <clears throat> you bust out your handsaw. You look for your buddy. Your buddy ditched you like three miles back and you're like, well, I guess it's just me now. And you're having to hike this tree down the hill and you're like, I didn't sign up for this workout today because I hiked way too far from the trucks. And you get yourself a beautiful Christmas tree and all you had to pay was $10 for a permit. But my permit didn't come this year. It's been snowing all week. I couldn't find the handsaw, thankfully. And so I decided to go buy a tree this year. Now, I could have gone to the tree lot. I could have gone to I couldn't have gone to Target. I wish. <laughs> I could have gone to Lowe's. I could have gone to Home Depot, but I made the decision to go to Costco. They had this beautiful tree. It was like $40. It's a real tree. It's a Douglas fir, but there is one problem with this tree and you're gonna see. So I told the guy, you know, you take your receipt up to the trailer and I'm talking to the guy and he goes, what are you looking for? And I go, oh, you know, something kind of short, like maybe like six feet, something, you know, not quite that big. You know, I don't have the biggest living room. And he goes, I got just the tree for you. He pulls out this tree. I lug it to the truck, throw it in. <laughs> Did you see that? Throw it in, bring it home. And this is what I got. Hold on, hold on. Got to flip the camera. Now I am a five foot eight lady, and this tree is probably about seven feet tall. It was, it's, it's big. It takes up my whole living room. Like, 
That's my whole living room, guys. Like, the coffee table's gotta go. Coffee table's going, pretty much. And we're just gonna have a tree as the centerpiece. You're gonna be like, where am I supposed to set my drinks? Well, good luck. Cause they are not gonna be on the, on the table. So tomorrow's video is probably gonna be me cutting a couple feet off of this guy. We're gonna, we're gonna bring him down to size. Who gets a seven foot tree? This thing's huge. Huge. So that is it for Vlogmas today. I hope you guys enjoyed. We are, ooh, that's dirty. We are just gonna end the video now. If you wanna see more of Vlogmas, as I precariously set you down, if you guys wanna see more videos like this and Vlogmas, feel free to subscribe. I have no clue what is gonna go on this month. It'll be, it'll be interesting. So if you wanna stick around and see more of this face, I know you probably don't. Uh, feel free to click the subscribe button down below. Leave a comment. I love to read your guys' comments. You just hit the cupboard. And I think that is where we're going to end this video. I hope you guys have a great day, and I will see you on the flip side.